Hello, Internet. My name is Quinn, and this is Blondie Axe. This is part four, the last part of the mortise lock restoration project. Uh, today we're uh, putting it all together. Uh, you saw me take the lock apart and clean it, and we made a new uh, shaft for the main handle. We need, made a new uh, bolt to retain one of the springs, and uh, now we're going to put it all back together. Okay, let's dive in. Okay, a quick recap of uh, what we've done so far. We remade this shaft for the main latch, and we remade this uh, bolt here that holds one of the springs inside, and also holds part of the case together. Saw that in previous videos, which I'll link here. And now we can reassemble everything. You'll notice that uh, the case and all the parts are black because I'm spraying them as I go with that uh, uh, black graphite lube there. It's uh, uh, graphite suspended in alcohol so it's dry when it's done and everything stays in place and you can see I'm working from photos there as I go okay so here's the assembled lock set all back together and uh, Looking fine. There's our bolt there that's nice and flush, so it'll go back in the mortise. And let's uh, check out some of our parts. Now here's the uh, dead bolt, newly cleaned up and lubricated. It's working very well. Now that shaft is still broken, so we need to deal with that. But uh, here's the uh, dead bolt that goes in there. And here's the, uh, the main latch with the uh, shaft that we made on there, screwed in and uh, you can see the set screws there, the original set screws that hold it in place in those grooves that we made on that shaft. And as you can see, it works great. Sounds really nice too. It's got that nice clicky sound. And the external latch button is working well. And these mode buttons on the front here that allow you to soft lock and disable the outside latch, also working very well now. They're very satisfying to push those guys. All right, now here's that deadbolt handle that's broken off, so we need to address that. And so what I did is I uh, took some uh, steel bar stock, squared it up on the mill, cut a slot in it that uh, nestles right over the broken end there, and, and then I just brazed it all back together. And I left it extra long uh, because I wasn't sure how long it would need to be so we can cut it to length on site. And a quick test fit there, and you can see that that works very well. Mechanism's nice and smooth now. Should be good for another 100 years. All right, let's reinstall this thing on site. So as I said, I left that shaft long, so I marked and cut that to length. And now we can just insert this guy back in the door. It's a perfect fit, thanks to the new newly flush uh, mounting bolt that we made. And the handle goes back on perfectly. We can set the angle of that handle by uh, just shifting it in the in the lock. Deadbolt works perfectly. Outside latch works perfectly. Mode buttons work. Everything feels really smooth, really nice, and perfect. So I hope you enjoyed this four-part project. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you next time.